bullets here in round two. Unfortunately, actually, the knife didn't reveal more of this stack. I don't think Optic even expected them to pop as quickly as they did on the back of that entry. Coming through as well. He takes so much damage here. And he's suppressed, so we can't even dash out a yeah. pizza. That's it, beautifully constructed. Taking them this half so far. So with nine rounds to 12, a couple more chances to try and close here. Nice and clean for Aspas, Back steals down, a victor. Looks like Marv's on the chopping block, but he's still standing. And we're, what, what the hell is what? going on? Ah. Cool, that's fine. Okay, I, think no. there was, I think there was a pixel, but I mean, bloody. No. No. The Marv's reaction. <laughs> <laughs> Just an absolute spray down. Between Les and Sarsi, they have no idea, and Aspas makes his debut on the round. And this is just <laughs> destined to Beautiful be Beautiful stuff. The setup, though, you can see it formulating. The cogs starting to turn. And it's a three-man crunch onto Les. They create a little bit of pressure on the back of Victor and Marv with that one-way in A main. With rifles now. And I'll tell you, none of us saw it at the start of this round. Aspas, though, good for one. Oh, my God. One for two. And now just the 1v1. The correct guess. Victor, none the wiser, forced to pull the trigger! Oh, Aspas! The unthinkable again! The 1v3 in the final seconds! Easiest kill of Ye's life. Guess not. Oh. Oh, he slipped the net. Don't worry, we've got this three is, on the side. So, he gets the kill onto Marv as well with the resale and the jump. And Victor swings. I think the paranoia is there from the paint seal, but. All the damage is already done. Victor swings ahead of the box. Now they're achieving this. I mean, louder laughing. They've carved Whoa. themselves the perfect start to this round. He wants the follow up, Aspas. Ripping through two of them. And Optic getting a stark reminder that this is not over yet. This series is only getting started. Pancada, in the meantime, going to collect on Ye. And here's the boom! <laughs> As quick as lightning, Aspas almost gonna catch Crush. He's too. First blood. And then even less there, the contingency plan on it. One enemy remaining. Such a. And a bit of timing, Aspas. This could be everything for you and your side, or it could be dead and gone. It could be all for nothing, and that is a problem. Now you're surrounded, you don't know how much danger you're in. You just saw it. Aspas has to run. Gets to keep his life, 87 HP, away. and he's still standing. And he's gone back for more. Oh, he's gone off. That's a spike now seen as well. So telling at this time. The rest of the team is on the way through caves. Are just so well punishing it. Oh, can you believe it? Aspas beheads crashes, and the other two turn plan. They're looking towards B. They want none of what he's selling. And off towards B we go. Victor and FNS, can you close it or is it OT again? Left. Less. The angle is One gorgeous. The kill towards Victor. The follow up is there. It's deserved. It is absolutely ridiculous. Heroics from Aspas. Another outrageous blade storm. Kill. How? How does he do it? And Less as well, playing his life so effectively. Safe. FNS actually gets spotted on. Moment. Now Ye and Crashies, no way have you got a way out of this water. Brilliant concept. What a fantastic start. Aspas again rolling it back, finding Victor and opening up an avenue. They're pressing this hard. They ain't gonna back away from this. One towards the stairs, one towards the top side over by CT. Algron doing its thing, but he's got support there. No one to close down the gap, but this is feverish. The pace! 3-3-8 three, three, to the back of the brain's gonna hurt. FNS is gonna have a headache. And Crashies, Marv and Ye left in tatters here. What do they do with it? Another one. Actually, the plane storm comes through, but it's Sadak to seal the deal. The prime gaming flawless in round 27. Allowed to go ahead on the other side of it this time. Another opener here from Tube. And he gets it so quickly with that updraft. It was just getting ahead of the time, blindsiding Optic. Aspas really looking to heat up now as well. The fact he was so present in this round, considering he's the only one with the rifle, was brilliant. Exactly whether or not they can spread the funds effectively here, so we sassy to play out. So much time, so many years of heartbreak, and the hands of Optic loud beat them in the best possible way.